Hey guys, welcome to another day, another video. And today I have a profit and loss question for you. Many a times in many entrances, you are asked one odd question from profit and loss. So I have picked up something which is a little complicated. It has too much of information and you will have to use your logic here in to find the, um, with the help of simple calculations, find the correct answer. A person bought an article and sold it at a loss of 10%. Okay. If he had bought it, had it been a case that if he had bought it for 20% less and sold for 55 rupees more, he would have actually made a profit of 40%. What is the cost price of this article? So, I'm going to ask the cost price of this article. If they're asking us the cost price, then I assume that the cost price let cost price of this article be B, say rupees X. Say it is rupees X. Now, this is rupees X. Now, what is it that he is selling it at a 10% loss? He is selling it at a 10% loss. So, selling price of this article of this article will be X minus 10% of x that is 9 by 10 x okay that is 90% of the cost aap nikal pa rahe ho 10% ka loss hai okay had it been a case ab ab sab kuch jo hai according to the question if ke sath aa raha hai if according to the question okay atq is for according to the question if kya kya hota if the cost price, if the cost price would have been 20% less, if he would have bought for 20% less, that is 20% less of what? Jo abhi ka current cost price hai uska. So if had it been a case that cost price was 20% less of what it is right now, that is x minus 20% of x. So you 8 by 10x or 4 by 5x. So cost price is what we if ke saath jo aa raha hai wo hum keh lete hain ki wo new cost price hai so question mein kya likha hai and he would have and and sold itne ka to usne khareeda hai he is buying it for 20% less x ki jagah 8 by 10 times x 80% of x and sold it for 55 more matlab selling price new selling price jo hota aapka wo hota New selling price jo hota aapka, that would have been old selling price, selling price, old selling price plus 55. Then you would have had a profit of 40%. Profit of 40% ka kya matlab hai? That my new selling price would have been for making a 40% uh, profit, the new selling price should have been cost price cost price which cost price new cost price new cost price plus 40 percent of new cost price okay that is 140 upon 100 of into new cost price so this makes it uh, 14 upon 10 of what is your new cost cost price it is 4 by 5 x of 4 by 5 x or in other words it would have been 7 by 5 7 28 upon 25 x that would have been your new selling price now according to the question only new selling price minus old selling price or in other words, I've taken it from here. Basically, I've already given you that equation. New selling price is old selling price plus uh, 55. So that means the difference between new selling price and old selling price is 55, right? So our new selling price is 28 upon 25x minus old selling price is 9 by 10. 
x that is equal to 55. So we'll have to do some amount of work here. Let's take the LCM as 50 and this will give you 56 minus you'll have 45 x is equal to 55. So you get 11 x 150 is equal to 55 and that means x is equal to 11 and 55 cancel cancel um, with a uh, you know multiple of 5 left here. So this and this gives you 5. So x is equal to 15 to 5 that is 250. So your cost price, original cost price should be 250. So is there an option? Yes, option C seems to be the correct option. Option C. Okay, guys. I have another question. Actually, why not? Let's discuss uh, another question. And this time we have a dealer sold a machine to a shopkeeper at 20% profit. The shopkeeper sold the machine to a customer so as to get a 25% profit for himself. The difference between the selling price of the dealer and shopkeeper was found to be 129. What is the initial price of the machine? Again, we have to find the cost price, the initial price. So we have to find that. So let's assume that it is X. Let initial price of the machine be equal to x piece okay initial price of the machine is x okay initial price agar x hai hame kya bola ja raha hai hame bola ja raha that the shopkeeper is uh, selling at 20% profit the shopkeeper ne 20% profit pe diya so in case uh, the initial price of the machine is x rupees and Selling price for dealer, the dealer needs to get 20% 20, 20 profit, right? So dealer is getting 20% profit on X. That means the selling price for the dealer is X plus 20% of X. That is 120 upon 100 X. Okay, that is 6 by 5 X, right? Now, this selling price of the dealer for the dealer is basically cost price of its cost price for the shopkeeper. Okay. Now, selling price for the shopkeeper. The shopkeeper needs to make more profit. The shopkeeper needs 25% profit on it. So, for whatever he has bought, he's going to put 25% more on it. So, that, so his selling price would become 6 by 5x is what he bought it on plus 25% more of that. So, that means we are here talking about, so we are talking about 1 plus 1 by 4, that is 5 by 4, into 6 by 5, x. So we are talking about selling price for the shopkeeper would be 3 by 2, x. Okay. Now what is given to us is the difference between the selling prices is 129. So difference between the selling prices, that is 3 by 2, x minus 6 by 5x is equal to 129. And we can find x from here, right? So 10, 15 minus 12 is equal to 129. That implies x is equal to 129 into 10 upon 3. So that's going to be 430. Do we have that in, as an option? Yes. C is the correct option. That's 430. Yes. So that's uh, how you solve profit and loss questions. 
just just use your logic and no matter how much information is there in the question i think when you have to demold the question and understand the language of the question kya de rakha hai it cannot be that difficult that your brain can't function and you know figure the correct answer believe me so it's just that practice a little more you know few more questions of this sort and uh, you should be able to crack any question given from profit and loss for sure hope this helps